Hello again, YouTube. Let's do some digging down in the basement, and I found a DC to AC power inverter that I purchased a long time ago uh, to hook up to my truck when I was camping. And I figured, hey, this would be perfect to hook into uh, the solar system. It's a 600 watt. It's got low battery shutoff, overload protection, built-in cooling fan, all kinds of goodies on there. We've got dual fans, and on this end here you'll see the positive and negative inputs. The other end has the AC outputs, on-off switch. Uh, it did come with some of the uh, clamps to clamp onto a battery, but uh, I won't end up using those. The wire though, 600 volts, 8 gauge wire, so I will definitely use that. I'll hook that up to the battery bank and uh, we'll see what I can see how much I can power off my battery bank with this. Again, that's 600 watts and uh, once I get things hooked up, I'll give you an update on uh, how everything's working. 600 watt will be enough uh, we can power up some lights and a couple other things that we may need. I bought a couple of battery cutoff switches. So these will go. I'm going to actually use one for the solar panels and one for the battery bank. These are a 12 or 24 volt battery. It's 100 amps continuous, 1000 amps surge for 12 volts, 50 amps, 50 amps continuous, 500 amps surge for 24 volts. So again, I won't be using anything near that. Uh, but anyway, they're there and heavy duty connectors on it. So I'll mount those up. And uh, just to add a little safety, just in case I want to do some work on it, I'll be able to cut the battery bank out of the system or the solar panels or both out of the system while I'm doing some work. Also, just, I also decided to put in fuse, a couple fuse holders. This one here, I've got a 30 amp inline holder so I'll hook that in and uh, I'll bring that in from the panels I'll end up getting a little larger one for the battery bank output but this will just help protect putting a 10 amp fuse in this uh, it'll take up to 30 so that way if anything if I get a surge or short or whatever may happen it's not going to take out my uh, charge controller and I will be picking up a larger one for the battery bank because I expect to be taking more power out of the battery bank than the 30 amps All right and again there's a little more safety for my uh, for the solar system thanks again for watching